Hello, I'm Antia Peter, reporting this week's news highlights for the Daily Express. Chief Minister Datuk Seri Mohamad Shafi Abdal said collections had started for the fund to help China deal with the coronavirus outbreak and hope over 1 million ringgit could be raised. Shafi said Sabah was not a rich state but it would do what it could to assist a country in trouble. He said the responsible thing to do is to support China, not just because of the outbreak but also the trade war the country is facing. Shafi said it is time for Sabah to repay China, having benefited from the tourism industry's economic spillover. The state government is looking into the possibility of being the first in the world to use biotechnology to convert tropical tree waste into plastic resin through the Benta X project. Instead of corn and cassava, the project is designed to use existing unutilized resources for social economic development and engineer industries away from relying on natural forests. The project is estimated to generate 42.73 billion ringgit revenue in 15 years, averaging 2.8 billion ringgit sales revenue per annum. The late Corporal Asman Onkal, who drowned trying to rescue students following a boat collision early Thursday, was described by his superior as an excellent and dedicated personnel. Commanding Officer Superintendent Toy B. Lamad commended Asman's ability to maintain composure throughout the incident as well as every effort he made to rescue those trapped under the boat canopy and get them onto public boats. Asman, who was part of the General Operations Forces Company C, had a strong physique and was part of the Tanduo operation. That's all for this week's news highlights. I'm Antia Peter. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for more news from the Daily Express.